My name is Carrie Amanda Thrall, and I am a second grade teacher and a small business owner for Creative Arts and Therapies. It's called Cat Scratch Studios. And in my small business, I do community artworks and I connect art and yoga and meditation. So the project for the Change Network is called Linking Fences 2019 because I started it in 2017 and I've been able to continue it for the last two years. This year I'm working with three different communities which is new and really cool to expand like that. We started with a denim drive to get materials and we got some other fabrics donated. Um, we've done material prep sessions where we cut all the fabric into strips to weave into a fence, like a chain link fence. And then we did mini lessons with a lot of different groups in each of the communities where we did mini paper woven heart. <laughs> so we're literally like weaving hearts together in the different communities and then weaving on the fence together in the different communities. Uh -oh. oh yeah. The installation is where we actually go to the fence and we're there working on creating a public art installation on a chain link fence with those materials. Okay, so the design for this one is the Black Hills. So here's one mountain at this angle, like this triangle, and then there's another mountain coming through here and then there will be one right here coming down and then we'll have um, two pine trees coming up in the foreground and so I've been engaging with um, nine different artist assistants three of them have created a, a bead design and then we blew that up uh, more modern to apply to the fence each one has a landscape in the center the imagery and then the sides have the bead designs and so there's three different designs for each of the communities but they're also woven together um, by what they are so in lower brule we did the black hills as the main landscape and then in lead and in spearfish we have the prairie and the missouri river and so that ties the places together in addition to all of the other work that we're doing it was just important for me to like tie groups together and like my long-term plan is to be able to just get people talking again and building stronger communities like within their community and then in a larger scope because I feel like when we're connected and we care about each other then we take better care of each other. The Change Network has really I mean, it just has changed my life, like really, honestly. My trajectory is different now, and I feel like part of that change is also leveling up for myself. Like, I have to become a different type of me. <laughs> just like starting to get really clear about what is happening and seeing a bigger picture. And I feel like that's something that the Change Network has also offered me because of so many experiences of like learning and challenging myself and getting out of my comfort zone and you know like having conversations about things that I don't know what I'm talking about and so I have to like put my ego aside and learn you know how to have the conversation and how to do the the new experience in a way that's going to benefit other people. I feel like getting to be part of this and connect with so many people and see other people's dreams coming true too in, in different ways, just it reinstills my belief in myself and humanity and like what we're here for. This project is not just art, it's not just connection, it's also healing, you know, and that that is a big part of it. You know, and people are bringing with them everything that's happened to them. You know, once you get past the age of five, like you start accumulating baggage, <laughs> and and that's it. Like that's the way it is, and that can you know cause a lot of disease in your life. And people will get sick. And if you can process it and offer situations to people where they're able to 
you know, like make the connection, have the conversation, be creative, and have success being creative on a project that's like out of nothing, you made something, that's kind of huge.